Hi everyone! It's Friday. Today I'm here to share another set of Memory Dex cards that I made for a swap that I'm in over at Memory Dex Swaps on Facebook. Um, I wanted to be in a vintage uh, Memory Dex swap, but apparently I was not added to the swap. I don't know why. Um, but I just went on there and asked if anybody would be willing to swap uh, two Memory Dex cards with me. Um, I'm in another swap as well um, on there too, but um, I wanted, really wanted to to do one of these. So I bought, I just got um, two new dies um, from Heidi Swap. It's the oval, um, I think it's the oval and ticket stub or oval and stub divider set, um, and these are hard to find. These dies. <laughs> at a reasonable price because I, um, what do you call it um, I don't know if it was Hobby Lobby or Joann's was selling them for dirt cheap and I missed out on it but that's okay um, I'm always late to the party <laughs> anyways I have to pay the price right so here are my two memory decks cards and I used the paper from Graphic 45 steampunk um, paper and uh, I love um, Graphic 45. I backed, um, well, I used regular cream or craft cardstock for my base, and then I covered it with the pattern paper, front and back, so it makes it really sturdy, because um, <clears throat> I'm putting metal embellishments on it. And I didn't want to use regular chipboard, because it would be, t I think it would be too thick. Um, so I'm trying not to make it too thick. I have a ton of chipboard that I need to use up though. So anyway, um, I distressed the edges. Um, I added some um, lace in the back um, from my stash. And it's a, a taupe and a, a cream color lace. I added a, a corrugated tag that I think I got from Target. I added a charm. I stamped out these words from this stamp set um, that I got a long time ago on QVC, I think, when they used to have crafting days. <laughs> and um, this has so many words, and I love how they're outlined. Um, they outline each word like that. And so I just stamped it, cut it out, distressed it and glued it. I added a charm from my stash and it says truth and this key, I believe this is a Kane Company key that I had in my stash and I just wanted to use. Added some pearl, black pearls. This tag already had the string attached so that is one and my second one is the oval shape one and added the same thing, some lace um, distressed the edges of the card, added a bottle cap that I altered, and I added the googly eye um, uh, plastic dome to it and, and backed it with paper. So if you've seen my video, a couple videos back I think, um, I show how I did that. And then I added this beautiful butterfly, it's a metal butterfly that I want to say it's a Jolie's butterfly, um, and it's metal, and I added some pearls to the center, added some swirl bling to mimic um, the flight of the butterfly, I guess. <laughs> and then I added Enjoy the Journey. So I love this stamp set. It is so cool. And I distressed the edges um, with the same you know, vintage photo, walnut stain, and uh, black soot on the tag and also on the words. So love that. Um, and then in the back of each card, I added my information, Handmade with Love. This one is a stamp from the Dollar Tree. And when I was stamping, I was stamping it real hard, and it added this really black, this look here. <laughs> So you just have to lightly stamp it, which I'm not used to. <laughs> so I added that, added my information, it's my YouTube channel, and then I also stamped the date 
of today with, I think this is a, uh, I think this is a Target stamp, um, date stamp that I got. Um, cut that out, distressed, I think I dist I don't think I distressed this one. Oh, bummer. I think I distressed this one. Yeah, I distressed this one, but I forgot to distress the other one. Oops. Okay, so anyway, the, the date stamp, I always do that to all my cards whenever I'm swapping. Um, and that's it. Those are my two cards. I hope my um, swap partner will, will like it. It was lots of fun. I can't wait to make some more. So thanks everyone for watching. Have a great day and bye.